Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be another bathing suit try on haul. Today's try on haul is going to be basically very affordable swimsuits. I saw that you guys loved the last haul and I figured why not show some even more affordable bathing suit options just so that you know um, you don't always have to spend a ton of money on bathing suits you can because trust me I like to spend on a Victoria's Secret bathing suits and then I like to buy like really really inexpensive bathing suits so I wanted to do this video and just show you guys a few options I'm literally going to go with um, the most inexpensive bathing suits that I found that are still like good quality so I guess we can start off with this one this bathing suit you guys is from Walmart literally cost me five dollars for the top five dollars for the bottom I love it it's super cute the color is gorgeous I got actually got this bathing suit in red and blue i wasn't too sure if i was going to love the fit or not but you know what it fits really really good i love it i took the little inserts out i always do on all my bathing suits just because i feel like i really don't need the extra padding so i took that out but it does come with like some padding in case you guys want it but it's removable which is great and then these bathing suit bottoms they're like not super like covering everything but they're not like too revealing you know like like they're 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 like a good amount of coverage if that makes sense so like i said these are from walmart they're five dollars a piece can't go wrong with that and they have so many prints i just went with basic colors because i like basic colors and i just like to mix and match so yeah i'm gonna show you guys I'm kind of going to go up, like, I started with the most inexpensive bathing suit, which is this one, $5, $5, can't beat that. And then we're going to work our way up, still trying to stay on, like, at budget for, like, I think the most expensive one was, like, $15 a piece. So, yeah, stay tuned. Let me switch to the next uh, bathing suit. So this is the next bathing suit. I got this from a Target. You guys, Target has really, really cute bathing suits. Um, I love Target. I love going there. I always go there for things I really don't need. And I think this bathing suit is one of those things. Like I went for like probably to buy something completely different and ended up buying a bathing suit. But I mean, you can never have too many. I absolutely love this fit this print i love that it's kind of like a little mini crop um so you if you go on vacation or anything like that you can pair this with like some high-waisted shorts and kind of just walk around like it doesn't really look too much like a bathing suit but it still does if you pair it with bathing suit bottoms i just got um i didn't get the matching bathing suit bottoms just because sometimes i don't like to like for it to be too mix like too matchy matchy so i like to mix it up a little um, I got these black bottoms. They have like this really cute detail. They're like little strings right here. Um, but you can't really see it once I actually put them on. They just look like they're black stripes. Really, really cute fit. Adorable. And I don't know, I just really like it. I think this top was like $9, I want to say. Same with the bottoms. Uh, Target usually always has the buy one get the second half off I think yeah I think that's the promo that they usually always have on bathing suits so they might look like kind of expensive like $15 a piece or something like that or $12 a piece but usually they have a sale like buy one get one half off so you end up really like not spending too too much on a set so I really really like this one like I said I love how cute it is how it doesn't really look like a bathing suit top too much you can definitely use this as a crop top if you're like on vacation or something like that so absolutely love it and i swear target just has some great things and they always put the bathing suits right at the entrance to like catch your attention i swear i wasn't going to buy a bathing suit and i ended up buying this so yeah let me show you guys the next one 
So next is this bathing suit. I got this one at Forever 21. Super, super cute. I actually got this in the winter time. I got it on clearance just because, again, I wasn't going in there to get a bathing suit. It just was there. It was on clearance, I believe. Like, bathing suits at Forever 21 are about $15 a piece, I want to say. But I actually got this on clearance for <sighs> $3.99. $4.99 I want to say so I guess technically for what I paid for this should have been at the very beginning but the bottoms were regular price so that's why I kept it kind of like in the in the <laughs> I don't know what it's called <laughs> you guys know what I mean like it would be the third most expensive bathing suit if I would have gotten it regular price if I wouldn't have gotten it um on clearance but for some reason the top was on clearance but not the bottoms so i got these high-waisted um bathing suit bottoms they're really really cute um these were about like 14.99 i believe so technically i did get these full price why the top was on clearance not the bottoms i don't know but i really like it um i've recently been getting into like high-waisted bathing suit bottoms um, I like some, like them, but not all of them because sometimes I feel like they make your butt look kind of like saggy in a way or something like that. I don't know. So it's like a love-hate relationship with high-waisted uh, bathing suit bottoms. And this one's a little bit different because it's like high-waisted from the back, as you can tell. So I, I don't know. I feel like it makes my butt look a little droopy. But from the front, it's not high-waisted. Um, the sides are, so it's cool if you want to hide, you know, those love handles and stuff. But I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this. The top, though, is really, really cute, and I love the design on it. Um, but probably really bad for sunburns. <laughs> if anybody of you guys get sunburned, be careful with backs like this because you'll have a very stripy back. <laughs> but yeah this is it i just really got it because of the color combination i just really really like these neon tribal type designs um but yeah i'm gonna show you guys the very very last one i think that's the most expensive one out of like the lower end bathing suits that i got and it's really really cute i still haven't worn it so i'm excited for summer because i got a lot of bathing suits this year so let me show you guys so this is the last bathing suit. This one is from H&M. I would say this is the most expensive out of all of them. And I have to say this is my least favorite. Only reason is because I think I got a small size. Like this is a size 8 you guys. Like a US 8. And it's so tight. Like, like I don't understand their sizing. Like my top is like way too small definitely need bigger like even right here it's like way 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 too tight like for it to be a size 8 is a little confusing to me just because I know the sizes I usually am and their sizing is like completely off let me tell you I mean at least in my opinion I feel like for a size 8 it should be a pretty good size and I don't know I just feel like this is way too tight for a size um, 8 um, I think I paid like $17 or $20 at the top and $20 for the bottom like I said I'm really disappointed just because it's really really tight and it's probably I'm not going to be wearing this out because I feel like any sudden movement like one of my boobs is just going to come out or something and the bottoms are just way too tight I don't I don't know I really don't like it um it just makes me, this bathing suit, the way it fits, it makes me be, feel very self-conscious and just not comfortable like wearing it because I feel like it just like makes me look chubby, I guess you could say, because it's like super tight and the top is like way too like revealing for my taste. Um, I don't know. I just, I feel like it's just not flattering like at all. So... I would probably not be wearing this or recommend this one, but they do have really, H&M does have really cute bathing suits, like the print on this is cute, if you guys could see, like, it has like, um, it's like a glittery top and like a glittery, like right here, 
it's super cute it's just that it's not flattering it's too tight too tight in every area i just i wouldn't really go with this one or maybe just if you go a bigger size but i feel like if you go a bigger size and it's gonna be like way too big on other areas like I don't know i just i'm not too happy with this one but yeah that's basically it for my affordable bathing suit haul hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up let me know what other types of videos you guys want to see like what other try on hauls i'm definitely going to be um, trying to put as much variety as i can on this channel um, i'm just like really just trying to put as much content up for you guys so hopefully you guys enjoy um if you do make sure to give it a thumbs up and if you are not subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for we're almost at 10k followers i know that's like nothing really that big but for me it is because i barely started to really focus on youtube and i definitely saw the difference from actually being consistent on youtube like i saw my numbers growing i went from 4k to 10k in about two weeks just because i was being consistent and i was you know giving you guys content so with that being said i will be uploading more and i will see you guys on my next video